almost 6x on my trade. So, you know, I'm not gonna let the diamond slip between my fingers. Crypto slow with more crypto gains. What's going on, guys? Ah, mm. we had that Binance shutdown where they were not letting withdrawals and we had a little pullback on BNB. So what are my thoughts? Well, number one, I warned you against running hot on Venus. I told you, what do I mean by running hot on Venus? That was meaning running with too high collateralization level. So what am I doing? What are my strategies? Um, well, I took about 10% of my BNB and I moved it into WBTCB. Just to spread my assets out a little bit, I've had insane gains on my BNB. I'm still holding my BNB, uh, but you know, if Bitcoin on the other side starts to run a little bit, you know, I definitely want to capture that as part of my supply, my supply balance. So again, it doesn't even necessarily have to be BTC, but that's just what I'm choosing to do. Um, just to diversify that a little bit to protect my collateralization level. Um, I personally have only been running at 40%, so it dipped down, I'm like at 42%. So, I mean, I have, in my original Venus video, I had that calculator. I mean, BNB would have to drop to like, I think it was like $90 for me to get liquidated. So, am I scared? No. But if you're running hot, if you're running like at 80, 90%, I do recommend you get some funds over there and buy and you know shore that up a little bit just so you don't have possibility of getting liquidated. Um, you know, you saw what happened. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? People will always trade back to BNB. You know, we kind of had like across the board almost all of the um, Binance chain assets. Um, have a, a big pullback. So, you know, buying opportunity, if you weren't in some of those that got super inflated super fast during the FOMO. Me personally, again, my primary strategy is getting more BNB. So I am not chasing those farms. If you want to use some of your BNB to farm these tokens, that is fine. But I never, as a general rule, I really never really like to hold like primary tokens as liquidity, um, you know, like egg and BNB. I would rather just be in a straight syrup pool and get the drip, earn my cake, if, the, you know, if that was my move. Um, but, you know, again, so what's happening? Um, the TBL stalled a little bit, you know, and we, we, we're gonna expect that stall in TBL because Binance was shut down for a while, so that was blocking input into the system. So I'm not worried. I mean, on the timeline, a healthy correction is, it was totally parabolic and people, you know, I'm at like almost six X on my trade. So, you know, I'm not gonna let the diamond slip between my fingers. So, you know, it, I'm holding, I'm holding. Again, I did diversify a little bit into BTCB on my Venus supply. Um, just because if Bitcoin jumps up a little bit, you know, I, I want to catch that buffer. Um, but yeah, yeah. So what am I doing? I'm not selling. I'm not selling. Because um, usually what happens when we have a blow off top like this, you know, you had some big whales that took massive profits, you know, when it was like at 345. And then, you know, it capitulates down. And then what you have going on is you basically have retail sellers panic selling, you know, and I've told you my view on Binance coin, the whole, this whole experience, you know, I've had so many people tell, thanking me that they, you know, have made life changing wealth off this trade. Um, but if you got in late, you know, as I said, don't get in unless you see this as a diamond hands trade. And I told you from the beginning, diamond hands trade when I got into this. Um, I've let many gems slip between my fingers. 
Now, does that mean I won't take some profits here and there? Yeah, for sure. I'll shave off a little profits, you know. I mean, that's 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 it. But the bulk of my portfolio in BNB, um, I'm holding on to um, for the long term. So again, I you know I feel that it's a it's a thousand dollar coin long term. When it when it will do that, I don't know. I think in the near term. I'm hoping we get this stall back, a little consolidation, and then we pop um, pop on to 400. Is kind of is kind of what I'm thinking is going to happen. So, but again, if you're running hot in Venus, you know, take care of that, manage that, because um, you don't want to get liquidated. So, and that's if your big orange box is close to 100. percent It's not good. It's not good. So, like, subscribe. As always, this is Crypto Slope. If you're not talking gains, then we're not talking.